Hello students, we are going to study uh, particle nature of electromagnetic radiation. Okay, wave theory of electromagnetic radiation explained about the diffraction and the interference, but it could not explain about the black body radiation, photoelectric effect, and the variation of heat capacity of solid as a function of temperature and line spectra of atom with special reference to the hydrogen okay so here we are seeing this for the particle nature of electromagnetic radiation but Bohr required only how many three of them third one he did not require so you have to study what black body radiation photoelectric effect line spectrum of atoms with special reference to hydrogen because these three Bohr required to explain his atomic theory of atom okay now here black body radiation was first explained by whom? Planck, okay, Max Planck in 1900, okay. Now, suppose explanation of black body radiation, suppose if you have taken, if there is a hot body, okay, it emits electromagnetic radiation over a wide range of wavelength, okay. So, as the, when the temperature is less, okay, it is impossible uh, to get so when we go on increasing the temperature it gives uh, the visible radiation spectrum okay now for example if we are taking an ordinary iron okay this iron when we heat it okay what happened it changes its color to dull red okay if we go on increasing the temperature it changes to more red the intenseness of red color increases okay and when we go on again increasing the temperature it changes to white color and after more increasing of temperature it changes to blue color so red radiation okay it shows its most intense color at a particular temperature and if we are taking another color like blue radiation it shows its intense color at another temperature okay so with the graph you can see but here you can see I have compared what wavelength with what intensity the graph has been plotted okay first we see what the uh, wavelength goes on increasing it goes on increasing to a certain extent okay here T1 and T2 are different temperatures okay and afterwards we see that what happens the intensity goes on decreasing so intensities of radiations of different wavelengths okay suppose one is of blue another is of red okay it depends on upon what the temperature now the objects of different materials will have different temperature and will emit the different radiations okay if we are taking an ordinary body, okay, we are providing electromagnetic radiation to it, okay, it will absorb, it will reflect and it will transmit the electromagnetic radiations, okay. So here it is showing what a uh, incomplete absorption because these ob ordinary objects, they rule by imperfect observers of uh, what radiation, okay. Now, if we are seeing an ideal body, not an ordinary body, okay. It will absorb or it will emit with a uniform frequency. Okay. And if it does so, it is a black body. Okay. And if only emission takes place. Okay. Emission of the radiation takes place. It is a black body radiation. And it depends upon what? The temperature. Okay. Now, this ideal body is always with the thermal equilibrium with the surroundings. Okay. And then only it is a perfect radiation. Okay. If the surrounding is hot, the body, ideal body will also be hot. If the surrounding is cool or if the temperature is less, its temperature, ideal body's temperature will also be less because it maintains the thermal equilibrium with the surrounding. Okay. Now, if we take an example, if we take a near to example of our ideal body, we can take it of carbon black. But if we want to explain our ideal body, okay, uh, till now no such body has been seen. But yes, we can assume that if there is an object, 
okay like this which has got only one opening okay and here from here the electromagnetic radiation enters this what happened it starts moving inside that body okay and one time comes it collides with the walls of that body and again it comes back in that body itself okay as a result what will happen there is no scope of water moving out okay so all the radiations are what absorbed over here okay and this is a now a perfect ideal body or a black body okay now here we have seen what what we have seen that if the wavelength increases the temperature also increases it reaches a maximum value okay what happens it reaches a maximum value and then it starts again decreasing okay so here what happened you can see the wavelength increases with temperature reaches the maximum value and then it decreases with or more increase in temperature so first it is here wavelength is directly proportional to temperature and then it is inversely proportional to temperature and this was not explained by what the wave theory of electromagnetic radiation so then max plan assumed that absorption and emission arises from what the oscillator okay oscillator is the whole body here what the oscillator electromagnetic wave is oscillating inside it okay he and he also assumed that that this radiation was divided into uh, discrete uh, units of energy okay it means it was not in a continuous form it was in a discontinuous manner okay and these two assumption gave the the relationship of the frequency okay he said that frequency changes with the interaction with the oscillators of the electromagnetic waves okay the it actually it was what in the oscillator what are they doing they are moving okay and they are uh, here and there and as the result what happens the frequency changes okay so here and he also said that atoms and molecules they emit or absorb energy in discrete quantities okay uh, which is it discontinuous in nature it is not continuous in, in nature and he named it as what quantum quantum means what small quantities of energy okay which is emitted or absorbed from the electromagnetic what radiation okay so here from here we can take out the relationship what that this energy is directly proportional to frequency if frequency is more energy will be more of energy is more frequency will be more okay and to remove this uh, proportionality sign we are using a constant that is planck's constant whose value is 6.626 into 10 to the power minus 34 joule second okay and uh, into the frequency okay so according to in this you can you can see that he was not able to explain the distribution of in intensity of the black body function of what which is the function of frequency and wavelength at different temperature so this is all about today of the black body radiation good day take care